All right, we're gonna do a little experiment here and we are going to show that air has weight. I am mixing together some baking soda. Baking soda is simply sodium bicarbonate and with vinegar. And vinegar is nothing more than a little acetic acid. So I'm gonna mix these together and I'm just gonna pour this in here. You'll notice we've got a reaction taking place. The, the reaction's kind of, kind of simple. I mean, it's not overly complex. We've got an acid-base reaction taking place and we're gonna get a, a product of what we call carbonic acid that's gonna decompose then into constituent components of uh, uh, water and CO2. And we're gonna collect the CO2 in here. So after this effervescence takes place, I'm gonna pour it into this container. And it's, you're gonna notice that the flame goes out. And notice, I'm gonna keep on making sure I'm gonna do it twice, I give you two scenarios. And you're gonna see that this, notice I'm not putting any of the liquid in, I'm simply just pouring out pouring the CO2 from the chemical reaction. And now I'm going to light up a match and I want you to see that it will go out. I'm simply lighting it on my little control plate here. And you'll see it go out once it reaches that carbon dioxide level, which is about right there. And I'll do it again, make sure we can see it. And it goes out right there. So that means it's got about that much carbon dioxide which is much like that of a, of a liquid. It behaves like a fluid. So it's being contained in that, in, that, uh, in that beaker right there. And let's try this one here. This one actually has, well, that one has about that much carbon dioxide. So we'll talk about that a little bit further here in just a few minutes on my picture lecture. There you go.